while. Mm -hmm. I can't remember who. I think it was Mama. Mm -hmm. The other little girl. And they kept cleaning the bathroom. So that was like useful. That was helpful. But then they used the same rags they, they were using for the clay to wash it on the toilets. And they just. <laughs> oh no. So they ended up cleaning it. But it was like. It started being a mess at mm -hmm. the beginning. Mm -hmm. But so then, then what happened? Um, Frisha told them not to clean the toilet because there were a lot of bacteria in it. So they just left them like that, and I cleaned them, and cleaned them up, and they ended up um, changing the towels for paper towels and using a lot of soap and cleaning the sinks down. So that that it, they ended up cleaning well though. It, it's funny because right after that, Hazel came up to me in the classroom and she said, I washed my hands really well because I just finished cleaning the bathroom. And I was like, oh, that's interesting. And the, the person whose voice I heard was Frisia because Frisia's really good about that follow through yeah. around anything sort of health and safety. I'm like, oh, that sounded like Frisia's words coming out of Hazel's mouth. <laughs> but that yeah, explains she told why. Me to keep reminding them about washing their hands mm -hmm. like every minute if possible. <laughs> <laughs> But they did a good job. <laughs> and so it makes me wonder, Nancy, if you want to talk about, you know, we want children to be part of that cleanup, and sometimes that's not the most efficient way to clean up. And it's just this tricky balance. Right, of engaging them, yeah. but not letting it turn into something that's not productive. Because mm -hmm. <laughs> they wanted to clean the floors too, but with the rags. So they were already dirty. And like they didn't want an, another rag, they kept wanting that dirty mm -hmm. rag. So picking up on their good ideas or a way where you could have said, you know, or it would have been okay to use that rag for something else, maybe even outside, and let's wipe some of the paint off the ground since the rag's already mm -hmm. dirty and being used on the ground. I mean, it's that thing of getting at what is the good idea here, mm -hmm. and it might, I might not be able to just let it flow with what they're doing, but how can I shift it a little bit and redirect it to make it into something that mm -hmm. is appropriate and I can. Mm -hmm. Sometimes it's even helpful, too, to do that thinking out loud. I know sometimes when I get stuck is I do that thinking out loud, and that's helpful. Hmm. I'm watching you do this, and you're using those rags on the floor, and then you're using them, and I'm thinking out loud because I want to do something different here. So then they're hearing that process, and that's useful because it <coughs> models for them that reflection of what can we do differently with this good idea. So if you're stuck, it's useful to just say it out loud. <laughs>